Tainted Kane was one of the easiest and most game wrecking characters in the game. Main point of him is crafting items, in recipes and pickups. For example, you could just type Brimstone on Platinum God and craft it. However, everything changed when you nerf dropped. After patch 1.7.5, each run had different recipes. That said, breaking with him was much much harder. Of course, sites like Platinum God adapted after some time, but checking recipes wasn't as easy as before. So I made my own version of checking recipes, much much more similar to the one before. Here's how to get it, contribute and how I made it. Enjoy. Let's start with how it was made. I'm not gonna talk about the nerd programming stuff, but explain how it works. Everything started when I found this repository on GitHub. It's a project made by Frto127 called Isaac Disassembly Raid. The repo contains a site, which allows the user to combine 8 items with a set seed to get the result of combination. I asked for a license and the license specified by him is Creative Commons, so I was able to use it in my own project. That's how the entire project started. I extracted the JavaScript code, changed some things and made my own website based on it. So how does it work? When you go into the website, you're greeted with this beautiful page. You need to put your seed and click search. Then you will see this search bar and a steps meter on the right. For this entire time you will be on this page, your computer will calculate new recipes. After a while, you can just type brimstone into the bar and check the recipe. After you reach the goal of 2000 recipes, you can upload your recipes to the server. But why? If someone gets the same seed as you, which can happen, they will get all the recipes instantly. Without taking more time on calculating them, I also made an Isaac mod which makes using the website even easier. It sadly requires to load a book. If you've installed the mod in game, you can just click F5 on your keyboard to open in the browser my website. We've already imported seeds and other stuff, so you can just take recipes more easily. Now comes the last part, contributing. I need your help, really. The basics of the site are there, and the site works, but it can be better with you. If you want to help code new stuff to the website, fix bugs, maybe even fix CSS, then be sure to check its GitHub page. Other than that, I recommend checking you the website for yourself. Bye!